I still to this day am reluctant to call myself a designer because I believe that designers didn't look like me. I see the term streetwear as more of a catchphrase to define a way of making than, you know, what people might determine it as like a style of clothing. My parents are from Ghana and West Africa. You know, my background was almost in a way opposite of the designers or icons that I looked up to, but I wanted to see myself in it. I grew up printing my own t-shirts and giving them to friends or the local skate things, and then that era was dead. architecture student like I had a professor that said I didn't have the pedigree or ideas or skill set to sort of work in any sort of important context so every no is perfect for me I thrive off a no fortunate to have Kanye as a friend and a mentor. The aha moment was like, wait, I can just put work out and if it's good, it works. If it's bad, no one notices and I can just get better at it. Pyrex Vision was sort of our early phase of making art. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling my feeling my feeling myself. As a creative person, that's not just one thing. I'm inspired by all forms of contemporary art and pop culture. So music and fashion and art, they're all linked, so I decided to participate in them all. Great, I'm honored. Uh, it's an amazing uh, uh, system of brands and it's an amazing heritage that I'm happy to participate in. Right now I'm only interested in editing something 3% from its original form. I'm basically tired. <laughs> Might be too old.
pressure makes diamonds, you know, it makes great things. So I embrace the pressure, you know, it doesn't really uh, have an adverse effect. It sort of fuels ideas. He's one of the best designers doing it right now. So, you know, we got to support him. I'm fortunate to be, like, have a great network of, you know, what I believe are the next generation of, uh, you know, models of our time. You can't talk about streetwear, specifically luxury streetwear, without mentioning the name Virgil Abloh. It, it's impossible. Um, his footprint on the fashion industry, you know, is is absolutely incredible and remarkable.